Okay, just to finish off me painting, I decided to use some burnt umber acrylic paint. Sort of heaps of water, just to sort of give it a bit more of a colour instead of just completely grey. And it's really sort of a light colour. So it's still going to look grey but with a bit of a brown tinge. So what I'm going to do is brush it on like you see and then sort of dab a cloth on it just to break it up a bit. just about coming out like water So I'll finish it all off. Okay, the next step in the ore dock is to place this in its place. Now, all I've got to do, I have a timber bean which I've just got to unscrew this top of and then put it on the dock or in its place. So before I do all the shoots, I thought I'd put it up in its place and make sure the height's right and any other problem I come across. So anyway, I'll take it off the base and take it to the train room. Okay, I'm about to place the ore dock on the on the bench. So here goes nothing. Okay, another view from another angle, leading in. And back down the other end. Now as you can see, I have a gap here which I've deliberately done because I'm going to put uh, some old shacks up here but down the other end my height of the track is not quite right so when I put my cork down She doesn't match up so I'm about a millimeter two millimeters out but that's all right I'll just raise this part up leading into that track but other than that that's what she's looking like 
on the side. I still got the chutes obviously. And I've just got to work out what to do with the hole up against the wall. Whether I just go for a railing like the front, which probably that's the way I'm going to go. And that's the brick wall at the back. So I reckon the brick wall has turned out really well. And that's with the lights on underneath the dock. As you can see, the brick wall, or the mountain, or the rocks has actually turned out pretty good. I'll show you what it looks like without the lights. Um, so the light's off, and the light's on. So I can go bright if I want, or lighter. Or really dim it down, depending on how bright you actually want to go. But anyway, that's what she's looking like. And this old paint sort of black because if ever if ever I get a boat in it's gonna match up to that timber anyway. So so far so good except for the height. And also the top lights are now on as well. Just got to straighten them up. So the bottom on and the tops. But anyway. Okay, she's all screwed and bolted down now. Well, screwed down, not bolted. So all the way to the end. So my other problem will be when I actually join onto the dock from my track, I might have to actually bring this out a bit more but anyway I'll figure that out just one more look it shouldn't be there 